Hey everyone, it's Tommy from the Glow Crease Network, and today we are looking at the Total Hockey exclusive, the Christian 990 stick. So, let's get started. Now the big question that everyone always asks when I get a new stick is, well, what does it compare to? And if you remember back to the Christian 880 stick, it compared very similarly to the Sherwood 9950. So people, of course, assumed that this too would be very close to a Sherwood 9950 or another Sherwood model. And really, it doesn't. In fact, in my opinion, it plays very similar to my CCM 500 sticks. However, it does have a super stiff warrior blade, which is really interesting. So we can get going with some of the performance and the durability. Now, when it comes to the performance of the stick, like I said, it plays very similar to the CCM 500. Now, what does that mean? It has a thinner paddle, in my opinion, and the CCM 500 did as well. Now, the pedal right here actually tends to be a little bit flexible and also get really good snap on it. The reason for that is, if you remember back to the Christian 880 stick, it actually has some carbon bars that go all the way down right here. And on this one, it actually only has it on one side. So, on the 880, it had it on both sides and you tend to get this really interesting snap to it. This one actually only has it on the front and that way it gets a little more of a front snap to it and it's not also the back. Now durability wise, that's not an issue because obviously you're not going to be hitting too many pucks with the back of your pedal. At least you hope not. Most of them are going to be hitting on the front and that's perfectly fine. Now at the same time, when we look at the blade down here, it's actually super stiff and it actually has the same technology as a warrior blade. So it has a bumper bar in it that makes it extremely stiff. So I really think that that played well with this sort of a snapping paddle and a very stiff blade because what you're able to do then is deflect oncoming pucks very easily. Now when we talk about the durability of the stick, like I just said, the durability of the front here is extremely good. You can see some superficial wear right here, not a big deal at all, and you can only see one dent right there, and that's the only dent in this entire stick, and that's after three months of use, so that's really good. Now in the blade, you can see, again, after three months of use, absolutely nothing right here whatsoever. And when we're looking at the shaft, I don't see any dents whatsoever. So I've been extremely surprised and very encouraged by this stick because obviously when you're looking at a stick and you're making an investment in a stick that's you know around the $100 price point or above, you want it to be durability and you want it to last a long time. And the Christian 990 definitely does that. Now as far as sizing goes, you can go on TotalHockey.com and actually find out the true size in comparison to the stick that you're using right now. Now in comparison to my CCM 500 sticks, this is a 26 inch and so are those CCM 500s and this is about a half an inch taller. So that's kind of interesting. So you just have to keep that in mind when you are switching sticks to make sure that you are getting the appropriate size for you. Now if you've been watching my personal videos for the last three months, you know that I've been using this stick primarily for the entire time. And that's pretty cool because I really believe in this stick. I wouldn't be using it if I didn't believe in it. I really like that this paddle right here is very thin because I have smaller hands. It allows me very good control of the entire stick and of the blade. And I think the interesting sort of whipping action right here in the paddle as well as the ultra stiff blade really plays well and really differentiates itself from anything else on the market. So definitely go to TotalHockey.com or run down to your local Total Hockey and definitely check out the Christian 990 stick. So good luck and I'll see you out on the ice.